Akinub the Druid, on a mission to defeat all the evil in the world, all by herself. She journeyed into the dangerous deadmines, putting an end to the Defias Brotherhood and ensuring Edwin van Cleef got what he deserved. She explored the mysterious Wailing Caverns to face Mutanos and awaken Naralax. She even ventured up to the imposing Shadowhunt Keep to stop Archmage Arugal from spreading the Worgen Curse. And today we return to Stormwind for a quick side mission, just helping out the locals with a little problem in their stockade. Starting with the trash. Nothing very interesting here. You can mostly just pull each one by one, and even if you get two at once, you can always reset at the instance entry. Already in the first room, we found Targor the Dread. Very simple fight, nothing much to mention here. From there on, it's actually a lot of trash we have to kill, until we get to the next boss room. Once we reach the second boss, just tank him in the hallway and he won't be much of an issue. In case you need to heal yourself, play it safe, as he can interrupt you with his shield bash. Coming to the first challenge of this dungeon, Hemhock. He doesn't just hit hard, but also has a Shane lightning spell and uses bloodlust. Luckily for us, he doesn't have that many life points, so in theory we could just burn him down before we need to heal ourselves. But Stockades has an unforeseen challenge that makes this dungeon much harder than I ever expected. Every boss has some adds close to them, which makes it very difficult to pull the boss alone. In case of Hamhog, there is one add on each side, both with a single target stun. So there is no chance of ever killing him in a fair fight. But you didn't come here to watch a fair fight. So let's start theory crafting. My idea was to use Magic Dust, an item you can farm in Westfall from Dust Devils. It puts a target to sleep for up to 30 seconds. And for some reason it even works on Hamhog. So I used my level 22 Hunter to run around Westfall for around 1 hour and farm as many Magic Dusts as I could. So coming now to Hamhog, I started with a sleep on the boss and pulled both of his adds to the instance entry, to be able to kill one and then reset. But the Stockage has an unforeseen challenge that makes this dungeon much harder than I ever expected. Every trash enemy starts respawning after 30 minutes, so by the time I reached Hamhog, the trash starts respawning. So while I was pulling his ad back to the instance entry, I run into respawn and had to reset the try and start clearing trash again. Now it became sketchy. I had to balance killing respawning trash while still moving forward in the dungeon, risking that my escape path behind me closes any minute. After I got back to the boss, I tried the same thing again, but this time I started on the right ad and slapped the boss afterwards. This was a mistake, it resulted not just pulling the boss, but also another ad. So again I pulled 3 and had to reset. So again, get back to the boss, but this time sleep the boss first and slowly pull the other two to the instance entry. But Stockade has an unforeseen challenge that makes this dungeon much harder than I ever expected. Every time you pull an ad near the instance entry, once they get low they start running away. If they run through the incense portal, I can't actually hit them anymore, not even with range attacks. So this means I had to wait and survive until the ad comes back through the portal while both the boss and two ads are smashing into me. I panicked a little here, but I managed to survive and finally got the first ad down. Now I felt confident to make a real attempt at the boss. Um, I don't have that much magic dust and it's super expensive. And I mean I farmed it myself, but still. This is so risky. Oh no. Oh, come on. Come on. Yeah, ignore me. No, he's coming. Can I just kill him? Can I just kill him? Come on, come on, come on, come on. 30%. 27 20 16 Oh, oh. Stun, yeah, crit Yes, 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 With Hamhock down, my confidence rose. This was, in my opinion, the hardest boss of the dungeon. Next, I wanted to finish the right side of the dungeon, so I proceeded to Basil Threat. He is also very close to two more ads, but it turns out he will reset as soon you leave the bigger room. So I decided to pull the first ad all the way to the instance entry. But Stockhead has an unforeseen challenge that makes this dungeon much harder than I ever expected. Every time you run past an uncleared room, or in this case a room where trash respawned, there's a good chance that you just pull everything from that room. So even though I started with just pulling two ads, I ended up with a whole bunch of enemies when I arrived by the instance entry and couldn't actually kill anything. So I reset it and tried the same thing again, but this time running much slower back to the instance entry. But even that didn't work smoothly, as Trash started to respawn again. 
and I ended with three enemies, but I barely managed to kill one of the adds before I had to reset. Now I did the same to the last ad, pulling him back and finishing him off. Finally we arrived at the end boss of this instance. We have cleared every single trash on the way and both of his adds. This should be an easy straightforward fight, right? Will he reset even while hitting him? No, there's another edge! Fuck. Okay, I'm stunned. No, 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 this is not good, this is not good. This is not good, this is not good, this is not good. I might be dead. No. 